Shocking news, everybody. Nancy has just discovered a hidden passageway. Let's see where this hidden passageway leads. Okay, you go downstairs to reach. Hmm. It appears to be some sort of hidden area. It looks like they really wanted to keep people out of here. I wonder why. I think this is the place we saw Rentoro and Miwako arguing in. Whoa! What is going on with the water? Yeah, the water looks kind of... strange. It's really murky. I don't even want to know what's down there. Let's see, what else is there to this hidden area? We have this... M. Stop it already or you'll be sorry. Why? Okay, we have a message from Yumi to Miwako. And we also have... It looks like I need another set of numbers. A complicated nonograms puzzle. Ooh, I can't wait to solve that puzzle, but we can't solve it right now because we only have one set of nonogram numbers. So, let's try to find another set of nonogram numbers wherever you can find nonogram numbers. Well, Rentro doesn't have any. We're just going to have to find them wherever it is we are going to find them. Yeah, let's just continue with the game, and hopefully we will eventually run into some nonogram numbers. How did it get so late already? I should get to bed. Time is marching on. And time is still marching on. Oh, no more homework? Ah, come on. I wanted to grade more homework. Okay, let's talk to our various characters. Hi. It seems like you and Rintaro were pretty close. Yes, we grew up together. I have a few memories before Lentaro, but not many. How long have you two been dating? I don't even know. A long time. You sound a little frustrated. Sometimes it's hard not to be with Lentaro. What do you mean? Never mind. I shouldn't be bothering you with this. It's not a bother. It's just that when he gets it in his mind that he wants something, there's just no stopping him. He's been pressuring me to leave here. Why is that? He keeps saying it'll be good for me, but really, he's just being selfish. I think. Uh, I really don't know. He can be so sweet sometimes, and other times it's like there's only him in the world. Was Yumi here earlier? Yes. Really? I'm sorry I missed her. Don't be. Anyway, it's always Blink and you miss her with Yumi. You'd think she was allergic to this place, which is fine by me. Why is that? Look, I know she's fun at first, but it's like strangers get fun, Yumi, and all we get is touchy, angry Yumi these days. What do you think that is? And Miwako doesn't respond. If you didn't work here, what would you do? I'd... You know, it's been so long since I've been asked that. I don't know. Something very different. Something exciting. With Lentaro. Is Suki wearing a new collar? Yes. Doesn't it look perfect? Lentaro must have really put some thought into this. It fits perfectly and it goes so well with her eyes. He can be so thoughtful sometimes. I think it's time for me to do something nice for him. I'll let you get back to work. Bye. Alright, so now I think I'll talk with Takai. Hello, Nancy-san. I need to know, do you believe the Ryokan is haunted? Yes, Nancy-san. This isn't a trick someone is doing. Kasumi, she is still here. I can feel it. She's trapped and she's scared. And she's angry. 
Do you really believe that? When I was a girl, the most beautiful sparrow from the garden flew into my room. I had been trying to lure it in with seeds I'd stolen from the gardens for weeks. At first, I was so excited to have her in my room, but not for long. She couldn't find her way back out. She became very scared, threw herself into the walls in a panic. I was so worried she would die. She was so smart and so frightened. I opened the windows wide and snuck out of the room to let her calm down. An hour passed, then two, three. I'd opened the door, and still she'd be there, crashing into the glass, trying so desperately to get free. Did she get out? Cosme is still here. I must help her. Well, thanks a lot for the story about the sparrow. I guess. I'm sorry, I cannot talk right and now. And she can't talk right now. Darn, darn, darn. We'll have to come back later. And I don't think Rentero has anything new to say. Hello. Oh, he does. So how long have you and Miwako been dating? Officially, four years and seven months. Non-officially, longer. And before that, um, a long time of me waiting for her to stop being so stubborn and agree to go out on a date with me. What does Takai think of your relationship with Miwako? At this point, I think she considers me part of the family. Or at least she lectures me like I'm one of the family. I'm choosing to interpret that in a positive light. Miwako seems a little annoyed that you want her to leave the Ryokan. Ha! Uh, tell me about it. Are you going to keep it up? Yeah, it's not just a selfish thing. It's for her own good, too. I should go. I'll talk to you later. Peace out. And I believe we just got a picture from our good friend Yumi. I'll take a look at it after I talk to Takai. Hello, Nancy-san. What do you think about Rentaro and Miwako dating? Those two are so different. When they were children, you couldn't keep them in the same room. Always so much fighting. That has not changed. Except now, they say they're in love. I saw watery footprints in my room. It was very strange. You must be mistaken. No, I'm positive. No, it is not wise to joke about these things. I'm not. I do not want to talk about it. All right, she's getting a little bit defensive. Did you rewrite my name in red ink? What do you mean? The name scroll in my room. It's red now. It's... it's nothing to worry about. I'll have it removed. Isn't it a bad omen to have your name written in red? No. Just don't worry about it. It is nothing. Can I help you with anything else? No, I think that's about it for now. I'll talk to you later. Goodbye, Nancy-san. Adios, Takai. Okay, I think I'm going to call Bess and George and talk to them for a little bit because Bess and George are awesome. Hi, Nancy, what's up? There were watery footprints in my room that led straight into a wall. Why are you still there? You've lost your mind. You know how in the scary movies you always want to yell, Don't go in that door! But they never can hear you? Yeah. Well, you can hear me, so don't go in that door! Call this mystery a wash and come stay at our hotel, which has a nice ghost-free view and a ghost-free pool and tiny overpriced ghost-free packets of peanuts. That's a nice offer, but I think I'm getting close to figuring out what's going on here. Since you won't listen to reason, you're going to have to listen to George on this one. Thanks a lot, Beth. Unfortunately, I don't have a clue about what to do with this one. But Nancy, whatever's going on out there, be careful. I will, promise. 
I think there's something pretty strange about Rintaro. Yeah, the way Yumi tells it, he's about as weird as they come. Do you think he could be behind what's going on? Hard to say for sure. Well, he may be strange, but sometimes strange just means strange. Okay, strange advice from Bess and George. I got a great picture of you from Yumi, Bess. Thanks. Yumi really seems to love those machines. I wonder why she keeps sending me these pictures. I don't know. Maybe it's just her way of being friendly? Interesting, interesting. Keep these pictures in mind, everybody. Takai is really difficult to talk to sometimes. I think she might be hiding something. From what Yumi says, Takai may be a lot less sweet than she seems. How so? Yumi didn't really say, but I get the sense that she thinks Takai might be behind the hauntings. She told me that Takai never believed in the supernatural until recently, which seems a little suspicious to me. I'll let you go. Bye! Yumi keeps sending all those pictures to Nancy. And I think as soon as you get seven pictures from Yumi... Something is strange about these pictures. I should find a place to print them out. Nancy realizes there's something strange about these pictures. In fact, these pictures contain a super secret clue. Let's go to the pachinko parlor and decode this clue immediately. What you want to do is print out all of the photos. Let me see, do I have to print them all out individually? Or can I print them all out as a group? I think you have to print them out individually. Alright, so let's print out every photo individually then. Do do do, you're printing out photos, printing out photos, isn't it awesome? Photo, 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 print out that photo. Alright, so can I look at these photos now? Yes, here are the photos, and we need to arrange them so those letter things are connecting. I mean, you can kind of see here, like those lines are connecting. Do, 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 do. So let's make sure that all of the lines are connecting in all of the photos. Okay, that doesn't look like a connection. This is a connection, this and that. Like this, something like this. All right, there we go. A hidden message. I need to talk to Yumi about this. Yes, we have a hidden message, and in the next video, we will go to Yumi and confront her about this hidden message.